Hi, uh, my name is Scott Harrington. I am going to be one of the speakers at the Astronomical League Convention this summer in Kansas City. My uh, talk will be on observing with binoculars. I grew up using them as much or more than a telescope for quite a few years. They were the thing that kept me going outside at night when I was tired or it was cold. I didn't have to put in a lot of preparation to use them. So I find binoculars very interesting. And after all these years, I've been doing this for maybe 15 years, about there, they should be the choice of every beginning astronomer. That's what I've learned. That's what my dad gave me as advice. But I look around and I found that they are not the choice of every beginning astronomer for some reason. And it's weird to me because they should be. So they are simple looking instruments. I think that's why they get passed over. Because I, as a seasoned observer now, like to promote them. And I think that more seasoned observers can promote them, but they themselves have had to have gotten started. So that's what I'll be talking about. All the benefits to binoculars and why even the best telescopic observers always keep a pair within reach. And you never know when you're going to need it. So the biggest reason to start with binoculars that I found is because if you go from the naked, eye and you look at the sky, how do you get to see fainter or deeper? Well, binoculars are designed for that. They have a wide field of view and a low magnification, whereas a telescope tends to be a high magnification and a narrow field. So they're an easy jump from just naked eye looking at the Big Dipper to binoculars and panning around seeing the Big Dipper. And they have a way of connecting me to the universe since I can use them during the daytime or the nighttime, I can look at, in the evening, a deer walking through the back of my orchard. And just a few hours later, I can pull them up above the tree line and start looking at objects that are not on this planet anymore. I can see galaxies, nebulas. I've seen a galaxy that's almost a third of a billion light years away with a pair of 12 by 60 handheld binoculars. So that's incredible, that range of just a few hundred yards to just unfathomable distance. And that is something I want people to remember, that it's really jaw-dropping when you can get that perspective. And binoculars, more than anything else, in my opinion, they can teach you what is possibly the most important lesson in our hobby, and one you should learn as soon as possible. Observing is done with the mind as much as the eyes. It's about teasing out an object from the vast multitude of stars in our galaxy and then realizing just what you're seeing. You tend to think that somehow the telescope will give you that. It doesn't. You still have to imagine what you're seeing. Try and read about it. Try and understand it. Binoculars are just the same way. You're not going to get a bigger jump with the telescope. So learning that early, that appreciation with your mind, is important.